Here's a burger guaranteed to knock even your mother-in-law's socks off. A triple cheeseburger. Okay. You want to start with about some 80-20 ground chuck. I've got about a pound of it here. And you want to break them off into about third pound balls. And try to make them as even as possible. Then, once you're satisfied you've got that done, time to form these into patties. And just, you know, press them down here like so. And once you've got your patties pattied out, it's time to add the seasonings to this. And this is going to be a real simple seasoning mix here. Nothing too fancy. Just a little bit of freshly ground black pepper. And then freshly ground sea salt. And then, of course, we're going to have some garlic powder with this. So nothing really too fancy with this here um, seasoning mix here. Just remember to season the living shit out of it because you're going to lose a ton when you put the meat on the grill. Okay, let's get these burgers on the grill. They'll take about five minutes aside. They're a little bit b bigger than your standard quarter pound patty. And then remember, you want to season uh, these burgers just as much as you did on the side that you put down on the grill. Like I said, you're going to lose a ton of it when you go to flip these burgers. So we'll be back uh, ready for the first flip. Okay, and through the magic of cooking show editing, these burgers are ready for the first flip. Look at that. Glorious. Okay, through the magic of cooking show editing, these here burgers are done. So, we got to top them. Now remember, I said this was a triple cheeseburger, so of course, we're going to need three different types of cheese. You want to start off with three slices of Havarti cheese. Havarti cheese will provide a nice little creaminess to this here burger. And then you want to put on a slice, a thick slice, of salami. The salami should be cut about a sixteenth of an inch thick. Trust me, just, just do it. I'm not insane when I say do this. Trust me, when the salami starts to render a little bit and fry up, it'll be fucking glorious on this. Now I know some food police are going to be going nuts. You're going to waste a lot of cheese it's gonna burn up yeah don't pay that don't pay any attention to them cheese is cheap the world is not gonna end if some goddamn cheese burns up in your grill finally so you've got your Havarti you got your salami and the pepper jack which is gonna provide a nice bit of heat finally to top it all off some nice slices of Swiss then close the lid and let all this melt up for a couple of minutes and we'll be ready to get them off the grill. All right, let's finish this burger up. You wanna start with a nicely toasted buttered bun. Trust me, take the extra two minutes and toast your buns. They make a world of difference when you're having burgers. Just trust me on this, just do it. Then, you wanna spread some mayonnaise. Some people don't like mayonnaise, I love it. Then, put some ketchup on the bottom bun. Nothing really too fancy here. Then you want to take some ketchup and place that on the top bun. So you got mayo, ketchup, mustard. Nothing too fancy here. Then you want to grab one of those big old juicy patties, place that on there. And, of course, you need some pickles. And you know what? I think that's going to do it here. Oh, wait. One last thing that I forgot. You want to grab some lettuce. And that's it. That's my triple cheeseburger. Hey, McIntosh, you think you could beat this? And that's a triple cheeseburger. So the next time you're looking to give your entire party a heart attack... Try this one out.